DeFi is coming to the masses. Ryan, do you want to tell us about Coin Market Cap and Uniswap? Yeah, sure. So a big problem with decentralized finance is its accessibility. You can't just go on Coinbase or Gemini or any of these centralized exchanges and use DeFi. But they are taking baby steps to become more accessible. Yesterday, Uniswap has integrated with Coin Market Cap. So now, uh, not if you're in the U.S., unfortunately, but if you're outside of the U.S., you can go to Coin Market Cap, uh, go to any coin that's Ethereum token that's traded on Uniswap, and you can actually trade it directly from Coin Market Cap now, which is really cool. They're talking about at possibly adding other decentralized exchanges to Coin Market Cap to use. Hopefully, then people can get the best rates. So Uniswap V3 typically has the best rates, anyways, because of their concentrated liquidity. Mm -hmm. um, and then in other news, Coinbase is looking to become the Apple App Store of DeFi. So Brian Armstrong, the CEO of Coinbase, has said that they're strong supporters of, of decentralized finance and they want to embrace decentralization. Um, so look look for that. Coinbase may be starting to add some DeFi apps to their exchange so you can interact with DeFi directly from Coinbase. Now, this is definitely more interesting, in my opinion, than the Coin Market Cap and Uniswap collab, because with that Coin Market Cap and Uniswap integration, you still need a MetaMask wallet, right? So you're not really saving too many steps. You still need to have a MetaMask wallet go on. It's basically the same as using Uniswap, except on CoinMarketCap's website. Uh, but with Coinbase, I mean, there's so many more users on Coinbase than there are on MetaMask. So there can be way more DeFi users just through Coinbase now, instead of having to download a separate wallet to use decentralized applications. Definitely. And you told me something interesting this morning that I did not know before, uh, but CoinMarketCap is actually owned by Binance, you told me. Um, and I thought it was pretty cool that Binance, a subsidiary Binance like CoinMarketCap would be open uh, to allowing Uniswap on their platform even before PancakeSwap, uh, before the alternatives. Um, so I like to see that. I love to see the, the crypto family growing, the crypto integration getting stronger. Uh, and I'm really just looking forward to the day when uh, that could be provided to the U.S. customers. So, so any one of you guys can go on to CoinMarketCap, um, which I'm sure you already do to check out the prices and you can use Uniswap right in there. Um, yeah, like Ryan said, you still need a MetaMask, but MetaMask is going to become very mainstream uh, in the coming years. If you don't have it already, a, pretty much is too. Yeah, especially in the in the crypto community and ETH community, everyone has a MetaMask wallet. That is the uh, the fastest way to get into the DeFi world. Um, if you're wondering how to set that up, we have a uh, like uh, an educational short three video series for you from getting uh, cash into DeFi. So we'll teach you how to get uh, cash to crypto, crypto to MetaMask, and then MetaMask into Uniswap, <coughs> DeFi, uh, all the likes of that. It is linked in the description below. It's called Crypto and DeFi 101. So make sure you go check that out if you're looking for more.